Hello guys, welcome back to our second episode of Playdate, where we are working through Deponia the Complete Journey. Now, I have not gone any further from where the first video left off. If you haven't seen the first video, I'll provide a link on the screen here to direct any of you who haven't seen it to watch the first one. You'll probably have a little more context that way. But other than that, let's get started. Where we left off, he said that we needed to pack a pod. So I'm, I'm assuming this is the pod that we need to pack. Your suitcase is right in front of it, conveniently. Now where shall I put it? Let's see... Can we just... Uh, click in? Nope. Uh, seat. No room there. Okay. Storage space, that sounds good. Storage space is closed. Oh. Ooh, okay. Battery. There, and now? Fits right in. There we go. Perfect. And then we have to put this in here somewhere. Can we put it if on the I seat? If I remove the seat, it might just fit, but how's it going to be attached? And more importantly, where shall I sit? Good point. Good point. Okay, um... Let's see, our harpoon, control panel, and a fuse. Wenzel... Tony's house. Okay. Um... Oh, a uh, wrench. Good, good. Uh, control panel. I'll have to prepare the escape pod first. I want to be better prepared this time. Okay. This will be the most spectacular departure ever. I'm sure it will be, Rufus. Okay, um, let's take a journey. Oh wait, can we take off the seat with this wrench that we found? able to do without this. Okay. Good. But how's it going to be attached? And more importantly, where shall I sit? Yeah, yeah, it's all about you. Alright, um... Wenzel. Oh, Wenzel. What's up? Oh, um... Do you also think there are boundless riches in Elysium? Don't know. I'm happy with what I got. Yeah, but I will have so much more. Aw, poor, poor Wenzel. What a jerk, man. Um, see you later. See you later, Wenzel. You've always been a loyal companion. My friend. My helper. My Look at his sidekick. I so angry. Your sidekick? I always thought you were my sidekick. What? Alright, I want to leave. Let me go. I'll go back to I'll work. I'll go back to work then. You better do that. You haven't got much time left. Tony's house. Okay, we were here before. Um, I know this is still locked. Can we... Luckily, I'm a gifted lock picker. Damn, that would have been a piece of cake <laughs> with the right tool. You have a wrench. Use it, man. Alright, uh, let's see here. We never even clicked on this door before. I don't know if we could go out last time. I don't think so. Probably not. Okay, doorbell mailbox. Uh, chili. Ouch! Hot! Hmm. Nope. I've been sitting on my butt long enough. Okay. <laughs> what? It's the worst doorbell ever. Um, what is that thing? No box. New problem. <laughs> oh crap! It's screwed tight. Well, that's inconvenient. Hello, Hannock. Hey, um, uh, well, uh, Rufus. Ah! <laughs> I'm really terrible with names. Is the tunnel closed again? Yes, we had another collapse in Sector 7. Another junk slide? All this trash is really driving me nuts. I'm glad I'll be gone for good soon. Are you? You bet. Well, 
I only know you won't be leaving through this tunnel. Did you see Tony anywhere? Tony? Big, angry, breathes fire. My former girlfriend. Ah! Tony! Well, I guess she's down in her store, working, like everybody else, except you. <laughs> oh, poor Rufus. I'll finally leave this junk heap of a planet. <laughs> oh, yeah. Another one of your brilliant plans? This time, it's absolutely foolproof. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You being a fool and all. But I reckon you running around here has got nothing to do with any other problem. No, it hasn't. <laughs> well, good for you. Mm. I'll write you a postcard from Elysium. You go ahead and do that. Okay. Um... I think that's all we can do out here, I believe. Yeah, okay, we're going back inside. <laughs> so it's just boiling away. Not a care in the world. Um, let's go outside again. Do we have? Oops, we have a mailbox, a seat, and a wrench. Okay. Can't use that yet because this isn't packed. Um. Oh, can we? Yes. Sweet. Ha! There you go. And then this can. Go here. Oh yeah. I'm a genius. Ha! There you go. There. The capsule is ready. Now, all I have to do is calibrate the harpoon. Okay. Easy enough. Easy enough. There. Too bad the two directions of the control stick are blocked, but who needs those anyway? The main thing is that the crosshairs are right on the tracks. And then, I'm gone. Ha! <laughs> this will be a walk in the park. Um, okay. Okay, we can do this. Um. Okay, so we want to get in this box, I'm assuming. Um, so up and over, let's see, how far does it go? Two down, one over. Two of, okay, so it always goes two and one. Okay, um, let's see, so it can't go, can't do it from here, and you can't do it from, you have to be, you have to be in this square to do that one. Okay, so if you have to be here, um, can't be here. You have to be here. I know this isn't making any sense. I'm just, I'm totally mentaling through this. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. You have to be here. Can be here or, or here. So my goal is to be either here or here. Okay. Aiming for one of these squares. Let's see how this goes. I may end up fast forwarding through a lot of this <laughs> if it takes me a long time. Wait, did I just get myself stuck? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my gosh, I'm totally stuck. Oh no. Um. Oh, thank god. <laughs> okay. Try not to do that again. Great start, great start.
Yes, okay. Okay, so what was it again? I wanted to here to here to here. Oh, okay, so I have to go there. And then there and yes. Sweet. I did it. Now, I'll just light the fuse and boom. Well, okay. that should be it. Stand by, Wenzel. What? Nice overalls, man. Hello, Rufus. Tony, why are you sneaking around like that? This is still my house, remember? Well, it's not as obvious now since someone stole my mailbox. Oh, that reminds me. I'm supposed to give you this letter. A letter? Rufus, it's almost time. Yes, I know. Sorry, Tony, but it's over. Once the fuse is lit, I'll be gone for good. If only that was true. Why are you here? Are you still hoping for a miracle? It would be a miracle if you finally disappeared for real. But in case it doesn't work out again, I'll at least have the satisfaction of seeing you injure yourself. Oh, that's sweet. Mm, I don't know what to do. I just want to get out of this conversation. <laughs> This is the final goodbye. It's too early to jump for joy, I fear. I'm leaving. For good. I gave up hope of that a long time ago. Okay. Oh, sweet. I'm done. Okay. Let's... Um... We have to light the fuse and we're done, I think. Let's see. But my... My items are gone. I can't pull down my thingy. To light the fuse. This will be the most spectacular huh. departure ever. I don't know what to do. Um, am I supposed to keep talking to her? I bet now you're sorry about some of the things you said. That's right. Starting with, you can stay with me. There's nothing you could say to prevent me from going. What a stroke of luck! That means I can't say anything wrong. No, it's too late. You can beg all you want, but I won't take you along with me. Can I have that in writing? I'm out of here. The sooner the better. Mm. I'm out of here. The sooner I don't know. the better. This is really weird. Um... There's, I can't, I don't know if you guys know what I'm saying, but there's like normally a drop down here that allows me to access my inventory and it's not there. And that's where my fire, ex uh, not fire extinguisher, my blowtorch is. So I don't know if this is a glitch or if I'm missing something. I'm going to go Google this really fast and see if I can figure this out. I will be right back. Okay guys, I'm back. Uh, so apparently all I had to do was restart the game. I think it was a glitch, I think it was just bugged out. But my inventory is back, so we are going to take this hand torch and light the fuse. Now is when it counts. Hullabaloo. And here we go. On to Elysium. Ah, well, maybe I should read the letter. Dear Mr. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are happy to inform you, blah, blah, blah. Get to the point, will ya? Unfortunately, the delivery of your screws will be delayed for... Please find enclosed a voucher for a pack of rivets. We apologize for any inconvenience this might have caused. Sincerely yours. Just a second. Screws? He wrapped the chain around his leg? Really? Surprisingly, he's not dead, nor does he have any scrapes and bruises. Uh, <laughs> apparently, the only thing we can click is 
the chain. So we're gonna go ahead and do- do we have anything in inventory? Nope. Okay, we're gonna click the chain. Uh, still the chain. Oh, okay. Wait. No. Okay. Ooh, what a maneuver. Hey, my suitcase is here too. It must have got entangled in the chain. <laughs> Just like I planned. Okay. We saw perfectly clearly that there was no suitcase in that chain throughout the entire cutscene. So that I don't know how this got here. Uh, I guess uh, writer magic. <laughs> What? We can't take our toothbrush with us? Oh, come on, man. Uh, hatch. Yeah, I'm getting dirt between my teeth already. I better leave it closed for now. A well-oiled gearbox. Ooh, can we wipe it down? It already has plenty of oil stains. Okay. Ouch! The wire's cutting into my flesh. I need, uh, well, something like, uh, uh, um, has anyone here got a bolt cutter? What did I tell you from the last video? <laughs> I specifically told you that you would need a bolt cutter. But nope, nope, no one listens to me. Ooh, I did not expect that to do anything. Oh, that's nice. Um, can we attack it? What? No. Hey, aggressive little bugger. Yeah, as long as it's active, I'll never be able to grab it. Okay. Um, I don't think we can do anything else. Unless we can... I'll never be able to open it with okay. that. Um... Let's see. Oh, there's a hatch. Maintenance arm and hatch. Didn't even attack you. Hey. Okay. Um. Let's see. Oh, cool. Oh yeah. Okay. Now we have a mechanical arm. Can we? Can't crawl through there. What can we do? We can cut cut the wire with the arm maybe? Yes, sweet. Very cool. I'm getting the hang of this guys. This I'm learning. Unbelievable. This is just impossible. I think I'm getting dizzy. Are you suffering from vertigo, Ms. Gold? You should have stayed in your cabin. It was foolish of you to go against my orders. What? What's going on here, Bailiff? Did you know about all this? Just a minute. All of you knew about this, right? The whole Organon is involved in this? Did you really think you could just keep it a secret? Wait until Cletus hears about this. But you won't be telling him anything about it. You will be a good girl and wait here until the Prime Controller arrives. And then? What then? I'm an Elysian, not one of his office clerks. How does he plan to assure my silence? Just you wait, Ms. Gold. I don't want to ruin the surprise. Holy smoke! A real Orbit Pixie! I bet you'll be pretty thankful once I've rescued her from the clutches of the Dark Exchequer. Let's go! Rufus to the rescue! Mm. Wow, he cannot fit through that hole. <laughs> oh, there we go. Um, 
Is that that's all I can click? <laughs> Take that! No, don't! Ah! What's that? Ah! Oh. Oh my god! <laughs> I just killed her. Oops! Guess that was the wrong lever. You damned fool! How dare you mess with the plans of the Organon men? Throw him overboard! You need to catch me first, but I'm much too fast for you, see? First I'm here, and now I'm gone. Here, gone. Uh... Uh-uh. I was so close, but no, the minute I see a beautiful damsel in distress, wham! Well, I guess that's just who I am. I'm simply a die-hard do-gooder. Okay, guys, I'm going to wrap it up here for the second video in this Deponia series. Be sure to like it if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want to see more of this series. If you missed the first one, go and check that one out. That was a lot of fun as well. I kind of explained my channel a little bit more there. Follow me on Twitter. I'm, I started up a Twitter account for this channel. I post things. I, I let you know when new videos come out. Uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.